Good morning, everybody. Welcome into, I was going to say, hey, MTV. Welcome to my crib. <laughs> <laughs> that works. So we have, oh, let me just let the door slam. We're going to do an apartment tour today. Um, I think we said we were going to do it at 25,000 subscribers, but one of our short videos like got 10 million views. So we massively, quickly surpassed 25,000 subscribers. So thank you so much for that. But here it is. We're going to bring you the full apartment tour. So if you're new to the channel, we've been staying in Dubai since November and we've been living in the Sonda Apartments, which is in the Rixos building. We started off in a two bedroom. Now we are in a three bedroom as we've actually got some of my family coming out to stay with us and some of Matt's family staying with us. So that will be fun. We've actually got Tom's brother arriving in around an hour. Am I arriving in an hour? Tom's brother. Oh no, yeah, Matt's brother. Matt's brother Tom, sorry. Because <laughs> I was thinking Tom in my head. You'll see Tom and Jazz, who is his, that's his girlfriend in the vlogs in the future. Um, anything else we should quickly mention? We're in the JBR area. JBR area. When we walk around the apartment and do the tour, we'll talk to you some more about what's around us and what's in this building. Yeah. But first off, let's show you the main space. Yeah, so this is as soon as you walk in. Um, we had to request another dining table because we are actually using yes. another dining table. So that was really nice of Sonda. Um, did anyone watch the vlog of us setting the computers up? Because we did that over in the corner with a different table, didn't we? Yeah, our home desk set up. <laughs> oh yeah, we had, wait, let me turn around. We had one of these tables. Yeah, and it was really high. Our desk. <laughs> yeah, and it didn't work. So they kindly allowed us to have another dining table. So this is a fully furnished apartment. Yeah. So we're renting it like this. This is all the furniture that came included. So there's a bedroom off to the left over through that door. Um, we'll check that out in a second. And then the two bedrooms are down this corridor here. So just a gist of the layout, it's kind of like two separate areas. And this is the kind of connecting area. You've got the dining table. We love these two seats, don't we, Matt? Yeah, there are morning celery juice drinking seats. And sometimes we just sit here at night when all the sky lights up and just admire the view. So this is what the view looks like in the daytime. And here's what the view looks like in the nighttime. So it looks absolutely incredible got the JBR buildings and then you can see a lot of the marina buildings and also like Damak Heights I think it's called and um, the bundle down there so yeah the view in the evening is absolutely incredible we've got the torch on me because you can't see anything okay I'm gonna jump back to summer in the past now that was showing you around in the daytime now let's show you some other parts of the apartment because the view is just as good on this side yeah it's so good that we have the city view and then this the um, sea and palm view I actually think one of my favorite views is from that bedroom over there in the evening from the bathroom um, so this is our desk area we've kind of just gone through the living space but we kind of saw that earlier um, this is our desk we've got two monitors and our laptops <laughs> yeah, our working area this is where we spend most of the time in the apartment to be honest on this area here we show the lounge a little more? I don't think everyone got a chance to see that enough. So yeah. Here it is. This is a better look at it. Kind of groovy tables. Kind of groovy mustard sofa. Yeah. <laughs> Interesting colour. I would probably but do a nice big L-shaped sofa as if I was actually living here. If we were furnishing it, yeah. Term. Um, and then, should we head through to the kitchen? Maybe you go around that side? Yeah, let's do it. And look at the ceiling heights in here. That's one of my favourite parts of this apartment. Yeah. The this high ceilings and then the massive floor to ceiling windows. Yeah, I, on my vision board, I was thinking about this the other day. We used to have a picture of an apartment with we did. ceiling roof, no, what's it called? Floor to ceiling, ceiling windows, windows yeah. with an ocean view. And now it's reality, um, which is incredible. Okay, so should we show the kitchen? What yeah, let's we do show? it. Let's start at this end. So we've got double fridge freezer. Got um, a lot of fruit in there. It's essentially just a fruit and watermelon fridge, that one. Got a so, Miller freezer down there. Two fridges, two freezers, which is good, especially with other people staying with us. We can like have yeah, a fridge. Yeah, delegate each. one to everyone yeah. else. <laughs> Got two oven, well, ovens and then a microwave, both Miller. And then this, they recently put in, which we're really happy about because we were actually having to buy like water out of big, big plastic bottles. So this is a purifier. So it's connected to the mains. And now we just fill our own water bottles up. Yeah, exactly. That so was good. one thing we were really happy with. Then you've got the dishwasher in here, and then a Miele induction hole. 
Um, anything else, Matt? Yeah, talk? I think now come this way, Summer, and let's show yeah. them the best part of the kitchen is that you can just enjoy this incredible view. Yeah, this view is incredible. I'll get out of the way so you can see there. We can see two yachts. So that there is Rixos. So the Sonder apartment is within or right next to the Rixos building. There are two towers next to each other. And the yeah. amazing thing about that is all of the amenities that you get. So downstairs, something we use pretty much every day, the sauna, the steam room. There's a gym on the second floor of this building. Well, just the lobby connecting the Rixos yes. and the Sonder building is an incredible kind of lobby area. Um, but yeah, there's lots of restaurants in the building too. And yeah, it's just a nice, I don't know, I can't remember what else. Yeah, there's restaurants, like you say, there's a um, spa area, I think, for women to get like, their nails and hair done. And before we go to the next area, I'll show you a little more of this view. So that over there is the Palm. That's the runway where the Skydive Dubai takes off from. And the best part about this area is we can just sit and enjoy looking at the amazing yachts. The uh, Yacht Boat Show, Dubai Boat Show, is actually going on at the moment. We filmed a full vlog of that. You might have recently watched that one. That and we yesterday. also filmed some yacht tours, so stay tuned for them. Yeah, they'll be on maybe this channel, or maybe either channel, I'm not too sure yet. Where should we go next, Matt? So, that bedroom, probably? Yeah, let's go into the city view bedroom. We'll show you a little more about what the entrance looks like. So we've got one plant here. Ideally, we'd have quite a few more plants around. Yeah. But obviously, we're, they furnished it for us. We have yeah. moved a bit around, though, haven't we? We've customised it, yeah. Yeah, because I think as well, the table was different like it was facing that way this plant wasn't there that's no. from a bedroom that's we, from a bedroom this is from a bedroom this vase was over there we kind of did a bit of customization yeah we're always going to customize it okay so got another big window here i thought this is a cute little area let me show you this view that's out onto the city that's the dubai marina over that way this bedroom is actually one of my favorites i think it's so big um, especially for like a guest room, this isn't the main bedroom. Yeah, it's a massive room. It could be the main room, couldn't it? So show us around. Got the large bed. These are such comfortable beds as well. They're just, love them. And then all the wardrobes. Um, so my dad's coming out to visit us and he's staying in this bedroom. Yeah. And Tom and Jazz are coming and staying in the staying other bedroom. In the other one. Yeah, nice bedroom for them. So this is the other part of the view that I wanted to share with you guys. So here it is in the daytime. And here's what the view looks like in the evening. You've got the incredible view out over there and through that side. And should we go into the bathroom? Yeah, let's do it. This bathroom, I absolutely love this bathroom. Like you say, this, we couldn't decide whether to stay in this room yeah. or the other one, but I still think I prefer the other one for the sea view, but equally, this is absolutely amazing. I think the other one, just because of the dressing room. Yeah. But I actually really like the window in this bathroom because some of the bedrooms, they're kind of like the en-suites in. Yeah. Well, ours has a This window, has the actually. best natural light, doesn't yeah, it? Yeah, that's true. Okay, so you've got the sink and the main bedroom has dual sinks. You've got the sink. I love how big the countertops are. Shower is through here. Really nice big shower. Yeah, We've lived so here for nice. quite a while now, but every time you walk around, I'm just like, wow. You do pinch yourself. Look, you can come out of the shower and look, let me show you. Look at that view. I think the first few nights when we stayed here, we were just like, whoa. Just looking out, weren't we? Yeah, and it's all around like, what is there, four big windows in here? So you can have a complete view all the way around. That is so good. And this, I'll show you guys what it looks like at night too. So let's click to the night version. And here's the view from the bathroom at night time. This is future summer in the evening. Um, yeah, you can see they're called the Alpha Tan Towers, I think. And then Matt, you can see the address if you look down the JBR walk. Our camera is very wide angle, so we can't probably see it that well. But yeah, I love the night view. Probably more than the day view, actually. But anyway, we'll jump back to summer in the past again. <laughs> Lastly, we've got the toilet through this privacy glass door. And now shall we head back to the other two bedrooms? Yeah, we've got a long walk now. A long walk. <laughs> and, uh, this apartment is huge. It is. Like, it is so good. It's so, we're so grateful to live here. It's been amazing. 
And because we spend so much time in the apartment working, I feel like that's a good reason why we're able to justify somewhere of this yeah. size. Because obviously we completely work from there, really. Okay, coming through to the next section of the apartment. So this is a storage kind of cupboard. The moment we're using it is like a shoe cupboard, but you've got loads of cupboards. Okay, we've got two more bedrooms, so I'll take the camera now, Matt, yeah? Okay, sure, yeah, I'll show <laughs> us the rest of the apartment. So we're gonna continue down the hallway. We've got a toilet in here, which is cool. I just love these large sink units here and the LED lighting around the mirrors. Okay, let's keep going down. We sometimes do sprints up and down this hallway. Let's show this bedroom first, babe. Oh yeah, bedroom first, good idea. So come on in. Tom and Jazz, this is gonna be your bedroom for the time that you're mm -hmm. here, so I hope this is okay for you guys. We've got the ensuite in here, which is a really, really nice ensuite actually. Um, it's very similar style to all the others. You've got the toilet behind the frosted glass here. And this, the cool thing about this shower, let me pop in there. Pop in then. Pop in, pop in, <laughs> pop it is that when you have this blind up and you're in the shower, particularly when the lights are off in the bedroom, you can see directly through onto the palm and the sea view. So it might not come that up that way on camera actually, but you can't see all the way through. I thought it was privacy glass, or does it? Privacy it? glass from that side. Right. Yeah. So this room has got wardrobes. We've got shelving, loads of stuff there. Yeah, lots of wardrobes. And like, I just think this room is so cool. I know Tom, if you're watching, when you're coming to stay, would have dreamt of a, somewhere like this to stay in and live in. So yeah. I'm happy that you're coming out for a long time. It's just, they're all so amazing and yeah. so grateful for it. And so grateful we can spend time with our family here. Yeah, me too. So this room, like the primary room, our room, which we'll show you soon, has these massive floor to ceiling windows. I think how much glazing there is within this building. Every apartment has these windows. Yeah. So cool. The one thing I wish there was, was a small little balcony. I know the building looks really good from the outside without any balconies, but there's a bit of space in the kitchen where if there was a little balcony, I would have really, yeah, really liked that. I totally agree. That's a key thing that would just make it a lot better, wouldn't it? So definitely an apartment with a big balcony in the next one we go to. Okay. Right now, opposite, opposite this room. There is a lot going on, but let's bear in mind, this is where we store all our stuff. So I will show you, come on over. No gatekeeping? No. So oh, this dear is, Lord. Yeah, this is what they, what they call the maid's room, but it's just a single room It's a single us. bed, and it has actually got an ensuite behind. Do you want to see? Yeah. Oh, it's in there. Like, it is, it's a nice room. If you were looking for a three bed apartment and you wanted someone to come out and you just need an extra bedroom, yeah. then it's still cool. Well, when your parents were going to come out, my dad was going to sleep in here. Yeah, he was, he? bless him, yeah. <laughs> we, would, yeah. we would have had to sleep next to our suitcases. This is the monitor that we've got as well, by the way, if anyone's interested. 38 inch widescreen, yeah, got two of them. Mm. Okay, that's that room, we'll leave that at that. And this is the laundry room. So we've got washing machine in here. Yeah, just there. cool. Bit of other storage, but not that interesting. And down here, this is like our storage cupboard for all of our technical gear. As you can see. And the chargers, about a thousand different chargers. Oh, so many wires. And this is our bedroom. So come on in. Exclusive look around our room. <laughs> we did tidy up for you guys. <laughs> yeah, this is our bedroom. So it's pretty cool. It's very similar to the others, except that we've got a lot more wardrobe space because we've got the ones in here and then we've also got a separate dressing room that we'll show you. Yeah. And then we've got the glazing. Yeah. yeah, one thing actually, I just remembered, is we've, we've got this structural piece through our bedroom. So actually, there's slightly less. Oh, gosh! <laughs> <laughs> I just fell back on the bed. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, not talking about the structural Look beam. Me. We've actually got a structural beam through the room. Whoa! <laughs> uh, yeah, I haven't actually, well, I have noticed it, but it doesn't really make a difference. I it's probably still... bored you there, it fell over. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, Oh, we? Yeah, ensuite? yeah, let's go into the ensuite. So we've got <laughs> double access into this room. You can come through here or the dressing room. The great thing about this one, the main room, is you've got the dual sink. We have dreamed of dual sinks yeah. for five years, like, haven't we? Cause Mainly you when I'm getting a bit closed and you're like... <laughs> <laughs> well, just because we always like to tend to brush and wash our face at the same yeah. time, it can get a bit... No, dual sinks is so good. Once yeah. you have them, you're never going to go back. 
And then we've got a bath. We haven't actually had a bath yet. I think it's too hot for a bath. <laughs> yeah, cold showers are the one. <laughs> but yeah, it's a nice spot. Like you can see the Ain Dubai World Blue Water Island. Because you can see the Ain in the reflection of yeah. the Rixel. We've done a couple tours on our other channel of the one bed, two bed and three bed. So yes. Actually, no, not three bed, a five bed. We five bed, a huge one with like the main view of everywhere. Yeah, the front of the building. It's like one. the next, next price point up. So then we've got a shower, monsoon head, <laughs> and toilet bidet. And then this, this is cool, this is our dressing room. Yeah. So this is another thing that we absolutely love. Like this space in here is so good. So what we've got is, is like my cupboard, and then like yours. No, <laughs> you've got loads. Cupboards, you've got like you actually took my the best cupboards. ones. You took the big ones. My cupboards is just like a few basketball jerseys and caps. Yeah, mine's not actually full at all. I didn't have any clothes either. No, that's <laughs> Does a good anyone thing. want to get us any clothes? Yeah. No, I'm joking. Yeah, we um love this dressing room so much, don't we? Yeah, it's so good. We've got an iron around there. And that's it really for this room. Yeah, it flows background. Yeah, low riders background. <laughs> Um, what else? Let's go to the lounge yeah. and talk some more about the cool things in this building if you are interested yeah. in living here. Yeah, so whilst, whilst we're staying here and even after we've gone, if you did want to stay in this building, we'll leave a link in the description below that you can book. And so, as I mentioned, it's next to the Rixos building. So what's quite cool is you have, well, it's an apartment feel. Like when you're in the apartment, it's super quiet. You would not know you're in like a resort style location. But then if you head down to the beach level, there's a huge lawn area, there's a beach club, there's a couple of restaurants out there, isn't there? And that's jungle the same gym. area that Rixos use, isn't it? The jungle gym. The jungle gym, what's yeah. that? The gym down there. Oh, like the kids gym? Yeah. No, it's not a kids' oh, gym. Oh no, the it's main the the wooden gym. jungle gym. Yeah. Oh yeah, I see what you mean. Yeah, that's so good. <laughs> you should know. You've been in there loads. Yeah, I see what you mean. I thought you meant you know the kids' play area. It's some kind no, of called like yeah. jungle gym. So there's like a there is a kids' um, kind of yeah. area. So if you want to drop your kids off and have a day in peace, I think you just drop them off there. The food down there is amazing. Oh, so good. Yeah, the, the, the margarita pizza and the fries <laughs> are a must. And then you've got around another four or five restaurants actually within the building. This, the building is huge. The lobby is like the size of a shopping mall in England. Yeah. <laughs> I know when we arrived, we were just amazed by the lobby. It is amazing. And then each festive season, yeah. there's like, um, I think Halloween, there was a huge pumpkin. For Valentine's, oh no, for Christmas, there was a Christmas, Christmas tree. tree. For Valentine's Day, there was a big car. Yeah. Now there's like an art gallery down there. Yeah, they're always cool. changing displays down there, which is really nice to look at. And then, like, like I mentioned, you've got the sauna, you've got the steam room, the gym on level two. So it's an awesome building. We love living here. So I'm sure if anyone wants to come stay here for a bit, you would love it too. Be our neighbours. Be our neighbours, yeah. <laughs> so cool. All right, we hope you enjoyed this tour. Drop us a comment. Let us know what you think to our apartment tour. Yeah. Have you got anything else to add, Summer? Um, no, not really. Just, um, oh, the camera's coming on to me now. No, I don't have anything else to say except from please hit the like button and subscribe. Um, not sure what else to say. That's about it. That's about it. Subscribe, yeah. We've got lots more vlogs coming. We hope you're enjoying our experience here in Dubai. Yeah, that was cool. <laughs> Hello. Okay, bye guys. See you guys in the next video.